So the coils would be uh, uh, at this level. Which that had worship case. And then uh, also would have cooling tower fill. So this pump was taking the water from the bank, whole water base, <laughs> bringing it up top, spraying it over the internal coil. That's correct. 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 This is a really uh, popular product for uh, smaller heat rejection tonnages. Yeah. It fits ships fully assembled, um, factory wired controls, mm -hmm. and so it's really easy uh, installation. Yes. Okay. Our next one is the DT fluid cooler. Wait, that's this is one uh, that's also uh, very common, but it's a little bit different than the first two. Sorry. You're Watch good. my life. <laughs> uh, in that it's a, a coil only fluid cooler. That's not good. And this so, one here? Yes. So there's no, there's no fill in here. So the coil surface itself is both the evaporative surface and Got it. The, the indirect heat exchange. Mm -hmm. But you're spraying water over the coil. Yep, we still, still fill to right. help cool the water that's right. going forward. Got it. Got it. So as a result, it's a little bit heavier, bigger typically than a fill coil hybrid. But the advantage it would have is some uh, seasonal dry operation capability. Okay. So, right. in, so you don't have to worry about freezing. Certain climates, yeah. It's very, very common for this to be able to operate dry around freezing. You got it. So. Is this one of the newer products you were saying? This is. Okay. This is one of the newer ones. Um, we recently uh, put our AeroX coil technology in it, uh, which okay. helps to uh, improve the uh, heat rejection capability and reduce the air side pressure. Is that a special fin type? It's a special tube shape. Oh, okay. So it's a streamlined tube shape. Makes it more aerodynamic. Nice. Yeah. Character. Then we have one more over yes, here. Yes, one more. It's over. Hey, Gordon, you're doing a great job. Man, I just I'm going to put my here. Why don't you? <laughs> Sorry. No, no, this is great. Yeah, this makes for good. You know, it shows you guys are yeah. busy because you're now getting the excuse me the top cooling towers. Correct. Thank you for that. So, yeah, so this is a, a model of our new Olympus V adiabatic yeah. cooler. That's something that you probably also saw for the first time last year. Yeah. Are you, are you, um, this is uh, uh, a new product for us and really is trying to give a, a, a product option on the end of the continuum where customers are looking for ways to save water. Oh, right. Uh, and so this would actually operate in a dry mode most of the year. 